If you've been on the internet whatsoever at all on any media social network, anywhere, YouTube, anywhere, you're going to find that Dr. Squash has been all over the place. You know their videos, you know about their balls, you know about everything that they're talking about. It's all funny. It's a market gimmick that is, well, it works. I bought Dr. Squatch the pine tar. Today we're going to do a review on it. Let's see what it does. Dr. Squatch pine tar exfoliation soap. Is it manly? I'm going to judge this on four different areas. The smell, the ingredients, in, the price, and how long it lasts. So let's start with the smell. This stuff smells awesome. It smells piney, but it doesn't smell. It smells piney, but it doesn't smell commercial piney. And what I mean by commercial piney is like the pine saw or you know the the pine tree uh, air freshener that you get for your car. It doesn't smell like that at all. This smells manly. It smells manly. So we got that taken care of for it. Now, as far as the ingredients. Got olive oil is the first ingredient, um, palm oil, coconut oil, shea butter, um, essential orange oil, pine fragrance, pine tar, oatmeal, sand, activated charcoal, uh, and clay, and also sea salt. So it's got what my woman considers to be really good ingredients in this thing. Otherwise, she wouldn't have bought them for me. Uh, as far as exfoliation, if you're not careful, you're not going to have any skin left. You are going to have uh, some red spots afterwards. You are going to have some red spots afterwards. And if you use this in sensitive areas, be careful. Price. This is man soap. People got this on the market nowadays. It's a, a gimmick from all sorts of stuff. Man this, man that. $7 basically for a bar of soap. It's five ounces. Um, so if you're judging this versus commercial soap that you buy, you're gonna pay five, six bucks for eight bars of soap. Whereas this one bar costs seven bucks. Do I think it's worth it? Do I think it's worth it? I think it smells great. Is it worth seven bucks a bar? That's where I'm gonna get into about how long it lasts. This right here is about, I've knocked about a third off of this bar of soap right here using it. If you look right here, you can tell the sand, the oatmeal, Pretty sandpaperish. It's black and it comes off black and it will leave spots on your shower that's black. So you might have to uh, make sure you, all this goes down the drain because if it dries on your shower black, it might be hard to get off. How long does it last? I'd say I've had this for three days. I've already knocked a third of it off. So I'm guessing that uh, a week and a half for seven bucks, really worth it versus your 99 cent big box store soap. At this point, I'm really enjoying the soap. So I'm gonna say yes, because this is a man soap. I wanna make sure that you guys see the ingredients. It says that it's made with natural ingredients, that it lathers without harsh chemicals, that it's handcrafted, that it's handcrafted in small batches, and that it's a uh, cold process. I will say that this lathers up pretty good. This one does. Now, I have heard that some of their soaps do not lather up very well. Well, this pine tar, it did lather up pretty dang good. And I tell you, 
I can't get away from the smell. I've read a lot of reviews and a lot of people like this pine tar. So I would definitely buy this again. Have you tried pine tar? Let me know in the comments. Appreciate it. I'm going to go through all of their scents. I'm going to let you all know exactly how much I like each one of them. Appreciate everybody for watching, liking, and subscribing. As always, if you ride her hard, don't put her away wet. Did I say that this stuff was made in America? Yeah, it's made in America. I want to thank everybody for watching, liking, and subscribing. And I'm going to be doing a lot more videos on this Dr. Squatch soap. So stay tuned. And as always, if you're right or hard, don't put her away wet.